Today we are grooming Amaya, and she is here for her first professional grooming appointment. She is a miniature schnauzer puppy. Before we get started, I need to tire out this little firecracker, so I'm letting her chase my broom. Okay, little puppy, are you going to be able to manage this? Are you going to be okay? What's that? Is that the water? Oh my gosh, you're frozen. Are you frozen? No, please don't drink it. Please don't drink it. No, please don't drink it. This is not soup. No drinking. So hopefully I got you exhausted enough that you behave for this, right? Oh, poor little princess. Poor little princess. So Maya is here today because they want to introduce grooming young, which they absolutely should for every puppy, but especially for schnauzers because schnauzers are known in the grooming world to be very feisty. Feisty things. No, no, no. Schnauzers are a terrier. They are extremely smart dogs. Easy to train. I had one for 12 years when I was a kid and she was a great dog. But the only thing about schnauzers that I don't particularly love is that they are extremely vocal. They love to bark and their bark is loud. If you hear a schnauzer barking, oftentimes you can mistake them for a large dog because their bark is so loud. So that is the only thing that is a bit challenging when training your schnauzer is to train them not to bark. Now schnauzer puppies, I think they look freaking adorable in schnauzer cuts when they're young. They look so cute with their little skirt and their little beard, but the owners do not prefer the schnauzer cut. So I don't think Maya will be get, ever be getting a schnauzer cut in her life. So today she's just here just to get her eyes and her lip hairs, her paws, her sanitary done. And that's usually what we like to do for puppies anyways, because it helps to introduce them to grooming without doing too much at once. So I am going to take her out because she is nice and soaked up and then I'm going to do her face outside of this tub. I know, water in the face. Nobody likes water in the face. Tearless on your face, right? You're okay, little puppy. You're okay, little puppy. Don't worry. You're okay. Good puppy. Good girl, Maya. Poor thing. You poor, poor thing. You're really not going to like the next part, I can tell you that. Good girl. The mini schnauzer I had growing up was also black. Something interesting is that while they do come in miniature and giant, apparently the giant personality is nothing like the miniature. So a lot of people that get the miniature schnauzer think that they would love to have a giant schnauzer. And I've been told that it's almost like a completely different breed of dog, except they look alike. So I thought that was interesting. I've never actually, I don't think I've ever actually met a giant schnauzer. So I wouldn't know. It's a happy hoodie. Okay, and you're not gonna like the dryer but we're gonna try to do it, okay? <laughs> You're so cute. It's okay, pup pup. It's okay, pup pup. Good girl. Good girl. I know, it's so scary. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. 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 It's okay. Good girl. More relaxed in my arms. I know you're scared. You're scared. 
Now I need to dry her head and face. And typically when a dog is scared of the dryer, I like to put them in the crate dryer to have their head and face dried. But the reason why I'm not gonna do that with Maya is because the owners might be trying to crate train her. So the last thing I wanna do is put her in a crate and make something scary happen to her because then she might not wanna go in the crate at home. So just in case they are crate training her, we're not gonna do that today. I'm gonna to try to blow dry her face with just the small handheld dryer if she'll let me. Okay, let's take the happy hoodie off. There we go. Okay, now we're gonna try to dry your face with a little dryer. I still think you're gonna panic though. Good girl. Some treats? Yeah. No? Oh no, you don't care for the treats. Oh no, you don't care for the treats. That sucks. I'm going to do a little brush out on you because you're going to have to get used to being brushed. Right? You're going to be a nice girl. Let's poke it. Oh, don't you dare bite it. Ah, 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 ah. No, no, hey, it's okay. So schnauzers hate having their front legs and paws touched. Yeah, that's spiky. You notice that she's pretty much okay with her back legs. No, but as soon as you get to the front, she doesn't like it. Nope, nope. Good girl, good girl. Yeah, no, don't bite. No, no biting. Little pup, we're gonna do your nails. No. Hey. Okay, I'm gonna distract you with some noises in a second. It's okay. Good girl. You see this one? Nope. Okay. Nope. These back nails are short. I don't want to clip them too short. You gonna smell these scissors? Okay, now I gotta do your eyes. You're gonna let me? Actually, that was very good. Very, very good. Come here. Very good girl. Okay, I need to shave your paw pads. No, good girl. This is just a quick little shave today, guys. I'm not worried about making them perfect. Oh, please don't get your face in there. We don't want to shave that. I just want them to be a little bit shaved so she gets used to it. So instead of eating the treats that I put on the table, she's eating the hair. Are you for real? She says, well, I am indeed, in fact, for real. Turn. Turn. Distracted by hair and not treats. Well, okay then. You're funny. You have so much to learn, little puppy. And you will. Nope. You're not allowed to bite them. You're not allowed to bite them. You can smell them if you want. She's more interested in the hair than she is the equipment. Ah, ah. Ah, ah. No biting. Hey. Hey. You're not supposed to bite. Sugar cookie? Sugar cookie. Yeah. I smell like a sugar cookie. After about an hour, little Amaya's puppy trim was complete. She did very well for her first ever grooming experience. If you liked this video, you can help support my work by hitting that like button, leaving a comment, and following along for more transformations. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed Amaya, and I'll see you again in a few days.